Howdy, folks. My head's not fully in the screen. Hold on. Uh, well, that's too far. Right there. There we go. Howdy, folks. Elgrax here. Welcome back to RimWorld. It's been a while. Um, yeah, it's been a while. Uh, that's, that's pretty much all there is to it. Um, but I've been playing this a bunch just uh, while I'm chilling on the couch. And I uh, thought it was high time to bring it back to the channel. Um, uh, Mod-wise, because it's so hard to not play with mods, uh, I got a lot. Uh, I got like a lot, a lot. Um, kind of the most important ones. Uh, basically, I've got a lot of the vanilla expanded stuff in there so that uh, just builds on existing stuff in the game. So you're going to see a lot of um, just... Uh, taking what's already there and expanding it, doy. Um, and uh, the other big one is uh, Dove's Hygiene, which is um, it means that your people need to wash or they feel icky. Um, and um, part of the benefit of that one is that it lets you introduce like central heating, um, you get ceiling fans. Um, as well as like hot tubs and showers and so on. Oh, my nose. Um, so yeah, no, I think I'm gonna sneeze. Hold on. <coughs> okay, we're back. Uh, so yeah, uh, let's let's go ahead and let's start a new colony. Uh, I'm gonna use my uh, adjusted crash landing because I just I hate I hate I hate bugs. I hate bugs, so I'm not having it. Um, so the only difference between this and the regular crash landed is uh, that infestation and deep drill infestation are removed because I don't enjoy it, so why even put it in the game? Uh, that's kind of where I stand on that. Oh, hey, Mojo! Welcome! Um, I am... I'm going to go for some pretty chill play. We'll go adventure on uh, Phoebe. And... Um, hey, in honor of Mojo showing up, Let's go with Mojo as a seed. Um, everything else is good. Alrighty. Um, so yeah, I, I'm, I'm thinking pretty chill. Um, I don't tend to go for a particularly uh, crazy game anyway. Um, I do like to have some hills because, you know, I want my resources. Um, let's just see. So, faction-wise... Uh, so yellow, purple, and white like us. So probably being somewhere near them so we could trade. Um, kind of digging like this road right here could be good. Or we could go here. I do like rivers. Rivers are kind of rivers are kind of cool. So we got a river. We've got small hills, which gives us something to work with. Uh, we're just off the road. We can walk to purple, white, and yellow relatively easily. Uh, we do have giddy up and go. So we can... Um, you know, get on our mufflos or whatever and trundle. Uh, growing period of 30 is uh, not ideal. I'd like a, a longer growing period. Uh, this is just so flat here. I'm not digging that. Mm. Okay. We're going to do this. And we're just going to deal with this, I think. With the, the short growing period. Uh, I do have to prepare carefully. What I'm going to do is I'm going to randomize and then just tweak. So I'm going to randomize here, though. Because what I like this screen. I wish this was on the prepare carefully screen. Um, this guy's offering us nothing. So no. Um, incapable of cooking. I love a psychopath. That's a weird thing to say. But, um, yeah. This, this guy, no health issues. He can't cook. That's not the end of the world. It means you can't butcher as well, which is unfortunate. Uh, but it's not the end of the world. Um, social 14 is fantastic. Uh, and Ascetic is actually really useful early on. Because um, he will uh, appreciate having the uh, low-quality bedrooms that we inevitably will dish out early. Um, what else can he do? Tame. Um, a little bit of healing. A little bit of art. He's not great. He'll probably end up being like mostly like dumb labor, but he's okay. Uh, we'll probably tweak the name here in a second. Okay, you have just so much going on here that that's no. I, I'm not dealing with these cars. Whoa. No, I can't. 
See, these are great stats, but this ain't gonna work for me. I need, I need someone who can violent. I need I need three people who can fight. Okay. Um, so this gives us what? More animals, more social. This is just the same guy. We don't need that. Oh, this guy's incapable of a lot. Abrasive is not great. Uh, medical is amazing. No social is not a problem. No crafting, no cooking, no... Well, it does have plants. Um, construction, mining... We need one good constructor. Oh. Okay, I think uh, Slick here is going to make it in. Uh, this is just such a good set. I mean, we've got a chief cook, chief miner, uh, decent social, so it can help with uh, trying to bring people over because we do have um, hospitality. Iron Weld is super good. Um, yeah, she's, she's good. She's in. Uh, we do also have, uh, I think you can just about see it here, we've got the, like, the gradient here, which I kind of like. Ombre effect. Okay, David. Oh my goodness, 19 social. Okay, what are we lacking right now? We don't have a good researcher, we don't have a good plant guy. Um, so let, let's work on that. Okay, incapable of none is good. Uh, we need, we need construction. We need construction six so we can get our our um power up i think it's a shame because this is some dope facial hair so i need someone with construction of six okay you have a stab scar so nope no i'm oh, getting all the wacky hair right now construction of six just a construction there we go construction of nine okay uh construction of nine Amazing crafting and art. Decent intellectual. I'm kind of digging this. So Sparkle's here. I mean, she's going to be terrible at shooting stuff, but whatever. Um, so we've got our... Oof. Two growing is not great. We're going to tweak that and probably just add an extra passion there, I think. Uh, okay. Let's prepare carefully. So, Mitchell, I don't like your name. Gates. No. Nah. Jones. Sure, Jones. You are a dude. Uh, acetic Psychopath is good. Uh, I don't feel the need to tweak anything on this one, I don't believe. Um, you do not have a lot of passion. Whatever. Okay, Slick. Uh, hair is amazing, first of all. Um, w all we're going to do... I was going to do that right there. You know what? I'm going to do that too. Just to help out early on. And then Sparkle's here. We'll see if we can maybe recruit a, a better planter later on. Uh, Sparkle's here. Let's see. You can't fight for anything, but hey, whatever. Uh... Having that nine in construction is important. Um, okay, let's just check out these relationships. That's all just people in the world, whatever. Uh, starting equipment. It's given us a great Dane. I can work with that. All right, let's do this. In we go. Uh, so yeah, you can see there's a, there's a lot of mods. There's a, there's a lot of mods. But... It's kind of the, it's the rim world. Why isn't it? Come on, give me that good music when we, when we drop in. <clears throat> so, as always, the three of you awake in your crypt to sleep, sarcophagi, to the sound of sirens and ripping metal. You barely get to the escape pods before the ship is torn apart. Sometime later, you land on this unknown rim world. As pieces of the shredded starship fall around you, you start making plans to survive. There it is, the guitar. Okay, everyone is in. Let's go ahead, uh, allow everything, and let's take a look at our map. Okay. I'm digging it. So we got this nice road here. 
we got some ruins down here with a nice free table. Thank you. Uh, which one's better? They're both normal. We got a bunch of limestone walls we could take. We even have some sarcophagi here. Okay, that's useful. I like that. Um, oh, interesting. I, I thought that was going to be a uh, helixion, uh, what do you call it? But it's not. It's so we've got the, the steam guys are there. Canfield Pond is a little disappointing. Ooh, we have arrow fleets. Interesting. Canada goose. Oh yeah. Um, I mean, just setting up here seems pretty good, honestly. Um, got more resources here we can loot along with some quartz. I do have a uh, mod for gemstones. Uh, let's take a look at the uh, Da Vinci. Good name. We'll train him to haul. Um, let's take a look at the wildlife. Oh, okay. Short faced bear. That's not great. That's one of the uh, alpha animals. So, yikes. Um, I'm just trying to see. Am I blocking anything important? I don't think so. Uh, okay, so cool. Got a bottomite. Um, Megaslot. Cougar. We got some aves. Pygmy mufflows. They're so cute. We got a turkey, tortoise, badger. <gasps> it's a European badger, not a honey badger. Man, I wish I could tame that. Some red pandas. Nice. Oops. Um, we have a couple of male geese, but no females. I love that they have a 25% revenge chance. That's amazing. Uh, we got some guinea pigs, arrow fleets. Uh, we have a solitary frog. He does not look happy. We have some hares, hedgehog, rabbit, squirrel, okay. So we got some stuff that we can hunt. Uh, I mean, first things first is probably just put a roof up um, in here. And then, i tell you what, let's... Okay, maybe we do come south here. Because this is some good land. Uh, or we could even use this actually. I don't. I mean, corner camping is risky. We need to make the most of the good soil, though. This is this would be very good, especially since we have a short um, growing period. We need to plant a lot, and like we need to plant way more than than we need right now. If that makes sense. Uh, what we could do is come set up camp here instead. It's going to involve a little bit of extra hauling, but we already have a lot of space prepared for us. And then just plant like all of this fertile soil with, um, hopefully rice will be fine. Um, so that being the case, let's go ahead. We will, uh, claim this. This is home now. We're going to uh, move that guy there. We're going to move this guy here. We're going to move this guy uh, here. So we just need to fill in a little bit here. Um, how much steel do we have? A couple of good chunks there. Big one there. Any in here? Yeah, the one there. Okay, we do have a lot of steel. We're just going to fill out with steel then, I think. So we'll just do that, and that'll give us a, uh, a base to work with. And then, for now, let's just put in a big old stockpile here. And uh, this will be uh, not rotten, not corpses, that's fine. Okay, uh, let's take a look at priorities. Um, let's do, let's do this, we need, we need everyone who can handle to handle, I think, um, 
entertaining is important. Uh, taming, likewise, important. Okay, you're gonna be wow. You're the only person who can cook right now. That's that's a worry. Uh, not a fan of that. So these two are gonna be growing. Yeah, we're not gonna put you on construction. That's fine. Uh, I don't care about these skills right now. We're just gonna ignore them. Okay. Uh, and we do have fishing, which is kind of nice. So we'll we'll probably put a fishing spot in here uh, later on. It's a good way of getting uh, some meat in. Uh, okay. So they should start moving stuff down. Efficient. Look at that. Already. Okay, we have a roof. That surprisingly good. Okay, and you're repairing already. Okay, let's, um, instead of repairing, let's get uh, some beds. Give me uh, three wooden beds. One, two, three. Okay, and for now we just need to pull everything in. Uh, maybe let's uh, move the, the meals in quickly. That seems a good priority. So now the food is in, that should mean yes. That's exactly what I was hoping would happen. What are you doing, getting more wood? Okay, that's fine. Let's just keep bringing the stuff in. Okay, we now have bedding. Uh, let's go ahead and think about growing. So we're gonna toggle here. And I mean, I really think we need to sort of go overkill here. Oh, that's a lot of options all of a sudden. Uh, this is what happens when you flip on some mods and you forgot what's what. Um, I mean, honestly, like... So let's let's look at growing time and growing skill because that's going to be an issue too. Growing time three days. So what's the difference between these guys? Okay, seems to me the soybeans are strictly better. So we'll have soybeans, and then let's build another zone right here. And again, another big old zone here. Let's put corn in. And let's hope. And then let's hedge our bets. Eggplant in here. We're not going to worry about uh, trying to get too creative here. Let's just uh, let's just do that much, and let's toggle that off because that's really oppressive. Oh, that's a cool mega sloth. They uh, they are usually in the brown range, so that's neat. I think we do have a mod that changes the appearance of the animals, so we're getting some cool-looking creatures here. 
Okay, good work. Jones just reached level one. Woo. Good work, Jones. Like we've got this nice big quartz vein here. Uh, okay, that reminds me. So now we have this. Let's go ahead and uh, create a couple areas. Area one. It's going to be inside the walls. Okay. We're just going to call this one safe. And let's create a new one. Um, right now, this is going to be exactly the same thing because we don't have anything else set up. But in time, we're going to add that door. Uh, but in time, these will probably change. Because um, we're just going to want to clean the inside, unsurprisingly. And then we just come here and we say, hey, do clean. That's your that's your target now. So do we actually plant anything there or do we just chop a couple trees down? I think we just, oh, hey, we got a soybean. Okay. Like two soybean plants. That's it. It's not great. Uh, this guy really does scare me. Um, okay, we got a lot of stuff over here that's not being hauled, so uh, let's let's bring this stuff in, please. Something just died. I don't know what, but it did. So that's just regular, right? Starvation. Just get up and eat. Fools. How many uh, steam geysers do we have? Six. That's a lot of geothermal. Digging it. I got your garnet. More steel, more components. Someone just changed into those. Uh, the uh, flag pants, I think. I got a little unhappy nudity flag temporarily. Okay, so we nearly got everything hauled in. Just the steel and components left. I don't know if there's anything else. Steam. I thought that Helixian uh, geyser stuff, I thought that was... I'm not seeing any. I don't know if that means that's just because I don't have any, or if it's because... I'm, I'm misthinking. Um, research is going to be pretty crazy because of all the mods. Um, oh, decoy sounds fun. Trench. Oh, okay. Looking forward to trying that out. Uh, ooh. Do we have a lentils an option or anything like that? No. Okay. Good to know. Uh, okay, let's let's uh, let's start thinking about setting up our kitchen area. Uh, ideally, you want to be pretty close to the uh, to your garden. Um. Now I should check. Production wise, I've got regular stove and sushi prep. Do I have. If I check my research here. Oh, that went away. Soup cooking, grilling. We can grill. Deep frying, canning. Oh, wow. Okay. So we're going to want a bigger kitchen than I uh, had anticipated. 
These are all dead ends, though, which is interesting. Uh, gas extraction. Okay, so yeah, so there should be those uh, helixian stuff. Soybean fermentation. Cheese making. Food condiments. Okay. So, we, yes, we do want a big kitchen. And we're definitely going to need a big uh, storage area. So, let's think about this. Let's go... Uh, if we do 11... By five, make that the kitchen, which is very big for a kitchen, right there. Oh, I've just discovered where the anima tree is. There we go. Uh, I'm probably not going to dabble too much with uh, that that stuff. Uh, I typically don't, and it. It's fine. Oh, this is annoying. They're offset. Can't be helped. Um, let's just do this for now. And then let's think about where we want to put some... You know what? Let's... Uh, production. Oops, I was on production. We're going to make a wooden management desk. We're going to put this in early. Uh, and the reason we're putting this in is because I'm going to put in some wind tur turbines here soon. Um, and in doing so... Oh, good work, everybody. Uh, you know, let's just have no visitors until we get guest beds. Um, so the wind turbines are going to go in. Uh, and the management, if I go to manager... We're gonna start off with uh, wood logging. Uh, all except that. Um, there we go. That's what we wanna do. So we're just gonna set one up to clear wind turbines. Um, what's the frequency? Uh, we'll do this um, daily. Should be good enough. And then let's make sure our there's our researcher right there. Okay, so we're gonna just do this. Like this needs to be high priority for us. So we're literally gonna take everything that was a one, push it down to a two, so the magic happens as a high priority. We're gonna go over there, realize there's nothing to do, move on. Um, as for where we put them, oh dear, someone just died again. I think a couple, like here, like that, should be just fine. And then we can go like this, and bring our power in, like so. <clears throat> oh, now that we've got our weaponry in, let's just check. Uh, Jones is a 2. Uh, Slick is a 4. Sparkles is hot trash. So, uh, in the morning, you take the revolver. Slick, you take uh, the thingy. And then you take the knife. Someone, wh whoever it is, stop starving. What is happening? Wow. That is a mega sloth that just got killed. Oh, wow. Hello. We get a lot of meat out of this. We need to get everything uh, up and running pretty sharpish here. Are you gonna die or are you healing? Because if you die, that's amazing. We're gonna allow this. And... Oh, hey, information. Thanks. We are going to allow animal corpses in here temporarily. 
And then we're gonna say, hey, go ahead, grab that. Uh-oh, mad hair, mad hair. Uh, you two, be prepared. Wow, you guys are bad at this. Oh my goodness. As you were. Okay, good work. You still bleeding out? I think so. Some of these creatures sort of heal. Like, I think Thrombos heal, right? No, this guy. He's gonna die. What a, what a blood fest down there. It's like Tarantino. Okay, how long do we have on this? 2.2 days. Okay, that should be good enough. Hopefully. Cool. Don't mind if we do. Okay. So there's our kitchen. And we're doing good on these. Uh, these guys are growing pretty quick. In terms of planting. I don't know if this is going to... No, okay. I was curious to see if that would affect things that haven't yet been built. It does not. Uh, you can get hold too. And uh, one of the mods that I, I really like uh, for beds is the one where you have to like make sheets for them and stuff. Um, I don't know. For some reason, that just tickles me. So we'll, we'll probably get some like, you know. It depends what we, what we end up killing mostly. What do we got here? So this is the soybeans. We're mostly planting eggplants right now. We do have some corn coming in as well. That's good. Uh, we do need recreation. Let's uh, let's go ahead. Uh, we can't do those right now. We could do archery, but then I'm pretty sure you need a bow. So let's just put a horseshoe pin for now. music it's so good I'm pretty sure there are some people who just play remote for the music oh time for a name already uh, sometimes I kind of like these random ones uh, not this one I need to be able to pronounce it They, they go through such weird Minthethiller? No, it's, I can't do that one. Fornado Confederacy? East Meaninum? Come on, give me something good. Self-Ruling Treaty of Hain. Okay. The Self-Ruling Treaty of Hain seems to work. Uh, let's get a good... Mate City doesn't seem to fit. Well, we got two girls. But no, that don't make sense. Lindsay City? No. Everton? No. I'm an Arsenal fan. Uh, Lantus. Town on the Ridge. We're, we're not on the Ridge. Banthos? No. Thatcher's Town? We don't have called Thatcher. That would be weird. Sprayberry. I kind of like Sprayberry. Alright. So for now, look at our world map. Sprayberry! Nice. Right on the oh yeah, you know, you know Sprayberry. It's on the uh, the Fenucci Sea. Well, it's just on the river leading to the Fenucci Sea, but you can say it's on the Fenucci Sea, and no one's gonna argue with you. Oh, Sparkles is not doing well with the. You know what, Sparkles? Why don't you come work on these tree, these down here? And we're just gonna order uh, these trees and stuff. To be cut and uh, what we need to do is work um, we need to do that plant cut should come ahead of grow that's just that's just good logic I think no no just work on the walls They'll, they'll cut these trees down for you because you're you're terrible at these 
Honestly, get get the get the turbines up. Let the let the plant guys deal with the plant stuff. Uh oh, one point one days. Okay, we're gonna have to butcher this uh, tomorrow. I was really hoping we'd have our uh, butchering table up before now, but. What are you doing? Oh, you're just having a little wash. That's right. Gosh, I forgot. Oh, man. Summer. Oh, boy. Okay. Uh, so this stuff will get flagged automatically to chop down. Um, we need to really... we gotta, we got to go on this stuff here. I'm going to be a bit more involved directly. <clears throat> um, just going to make a little note here. Uh, so, <clears throat> today in game, uh, this guy's got 12 hours. So, we're going to go ahead and uh, put a break in here uh, for YouTube. Um, when we come back, uh, plan is get the... Uh, get. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm pointing at the, the screen. It doesn't help you any. Cause here, if I, if I point... I get the... Uh, there we go. I'm pointing at your screen now. We need to get the, 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 the refrigerator under control. Um, I'm not saying we have to get everything done, but we need to get the refrigerator under control. Uh, we're going to chop this mega sloth up so we don't waste it. Um, all that will be figured out in the next episode. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, if you did enjoy, uh, please do uh, subscribe if you're not already subscribed. Um, the first episode of a new series is very important. Uh, that's the one that kind of, you know, gets everyone in. So if you're enjoying what you see, uh, give it a like. Subscribe if you're not already. And uh, you can also see it on Twitch. Uh, just I stream pretty consistently uh, early mornings, uh, Eastern time, and then just every now and then randomly. Um, so yeah, uh, if you uh, follow me on Twitch, you can uh, see stuff as it happens. Otherwise, you have to kind of wait for a delay. Uh, but thank you very much. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.